Hello guys, this is Tina. How are you doing today? Uh, we are continue on the queries, JPL queries section and uh, we're gonna have several videos about the joins and uh, the joins has two types in um, JPA. The first one is uh, implicit join, the other one is explicit join, okay? So for this video, we are gonna talk about uh, both of them. Um, and uh, we're gonna have another video, which is uh, if we want to join, uh, join a collection, then we must do using explicit join. Okay, implicit join only available when we join to a single object, which is a two one, many two one, one two one, follow reference. Okay, so let's uh, give us give some demo here. Okay, so uh, let's using both of them uh, join. Hmm. Okay, so now private. Uh, let me copy, okay, copy, join, and uh, here, suppose, uh, let's see if I have, let me give us, give another, another, which is uh, called uh, Washington, let's call another city, another city, which is uh, Des Moines. Two, 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 and uh, north, uh, south, uh, fifth street, and this using uh, seven, five, six. Okay, and I use this one is uh, to the second uh, address. Okay, so now let's take a look. I change the code. Add an, now we in our database we have two address, and for the person one and two, we are associated with the first address, and the person two we are associated uh, person three, we are associated with second address. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, what we're gonna do is uh, suppose I want to find the person where they live in. Uh, how about they live in Iowa, okay, which is uh, which is the state or it's a city? Uh, state, state is Iowa, okay, state is Iowa. Got an idea? I want to find the all the people which they live in the city, Iowa. How to do that? There are two ways to do that. The first way is using in, ex, implicit join. me and here what is explicit join uh, implicit join implicit join means uh, follow the reference in the person we have address and from the address we can get the city so how to do that well p dot address then address has a city Excuse me. City equals Iowa. Okay, this is called uh, implicit join, and the implicit join can be only used when you have a two one relationship. Suppose you have a collection of addresses, then you cannot write a code like this. Collections you must using imp uh, explicit implicit. Uh, you must using explicit join. Okay, first uh, we will test if this one works or not. Okay, so she so should give us two objects, right? The first user and the second user, first person and the second person, because the third person live in Des Moines. Okay, so let's run. Okay. Eh? Eh? 
Uh, it only give us one user. Why? Joe. Where p dot is our. Let's take a look at the database. Okay. And we have address. Yeah, it's a fair field error. And let's go to see the person. Person address one and address two. E? But in this case, it only give us the one one result. Oh! <laughs> oh, we didn't call it. I was thinking why nothing is wrong. Oh my god. We didn't call join. Okay, let's call join. Oh my god. Forgot about it. This I was so surprised, you know. I didn't I didn't know which part is wrong. Hmm. This time is empty. Let's take a look at address. Ah, oh, empty. <laughs> the state is Iowa. I using city. City should be Fairfield or Washington. I have to use in the state. Okay, state, state. Continue how surprising. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Now it's correct. Okay, you are see John and the James they live in the state Iowa okay so this is the first way and for the second way we are gonna talk about uh, uh, implicit join okay uh, ex explicit policy join which is you have you using the keyword join by ourselves okay and how to do that is uh, not like this way and uh, p join p dot p dot address a d d r okay give a nickname where a d d r dot state is equals iowa okay and uh, this is called uh, explicitly join because we have a join keyword here and uh, for a collection this is the only way you can use in uh, implicit join can only used for two one relationship one many to one one to one okay let's run and see if everything works okay Cannot create type of the query. Ah, you know what? Because when we using uh, this join, it gonna return a person and uh, the address. Okay, we will talk about this one later when we talk about uh, the collection join. The problem is uh, cannot create type of query for query with more than one returning using request result type. If we using object, eh, but object cannot give. When we join, the result gonna be person. Um, okay, let me show you the result in the note. This one, okay. Create a new page. So after we have a join, the result is going to be look like this way. <clears throat> it's going to be like this. Okay, it's going to be, uh, it's going to be like this. After we join, the result is going to be like this. Okay, John, uh, one, John, D-O-E, and uh, Fairfield, Iowa and all the things and uh, this is id for the uh, street okay and two gems and uh, brown and two uh, fairfield iowa and something so because you can see t now now this is our re this is a result set returned by this one okay this query this query gonna return this thing 
one John Doe, one Fairfield Elwa, two James Brown, two Fairfield Elwa. And uh, this, uh, the record cannot map to a person. That's what it means. Type the query with more than one returning use result, uh, res request the type, uh, result uh, type, which means this record, like a first, this, 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 this record cannot map to the person here. Okay, because you have extra information about the city, uh, street address. And to do that, we have to explicitly tell. Okay, I only need the person. That's the problem. Okay, good. See here, now it works. Okay, you got the wide exception now, right? Because this role cannot map to a person. You have to explicitly tell, I only need a person here. If you want to be like this one, either you create another object to hold the value, or you have to give a project here instead of a person. Okay. So uh, that's it for this video. Just to briefly introduce I implicit join and explicit join. Okay, and uh, we're gonna have other videos about uh, join a collection. Okay, thank you for watching and uh, see you next time. Bye bye.